Daniel Ricciardo's return to the Formula 1 paddock has been revealed. It is a while away in the latest update on Ricciardo's hand injury. The comeback season for Daniel Ricciardo has been far from optimum. After replacing Nick DeFries two races before the mid-season break, the 34-year-old looked in good form before an unfortunate crash in Zandvoort, which ruled him out from racing once again. After surgery though, Helmut Marker revealed the full extent of the 34-year-old's injury, as he admitted to Ricciardo having seven fractures. With each passing race, the tale of Ricardo's return adds a new page to it. While there were hopes of the Austrian driver racing in Singapore, it was later revealed that he would only be involved in an engineering role in the paddock. The Qatar Grand Prix was next in line for Ricardo's return, but the race reports Edel's words as he states that Ricardo won't be back for a while. He was quoted as saying, the comeback is still a while away, so we wouldn't want to put a target on it. From our side and his side, there's no rush to get him back too early. Edels added that the recovery was going well for Ricardo and that the team has planned some simulator work for him soon. Judging by his words, the earliest possible comeback for Ricardo should be the US Grand Prix later in October. As such though, Lawson has one more race to leave a lasting impression, despite Ricardo and Tsunoda being named AlphaTauri drivers for the next season. Uh, it's disappointing that he hasn't been able to come back for quite some time, but hopefully now with this new update we should see him uh, late October. Disappointing, we would have liked to have seen him back in Qatar, but we understand that he is trying to recover with his hand, and they don't want to rush it uh, and cause any further injuries on his half. Uh, so, yeah, glad to see though that that recovery is going quite well, and we should see him back in the paddock very, very soon.